Hey guys, it's uh, Cheese Toast here, and um, today I'm going to be teaching you how to edit the X's and stuff um, in your codes. So this this is for mostly any game, except activators are different for every game. So I'm going to start off with activators for Black Ops. It's pretty much the same with every game. Um, but I don't really know much about the other games, but it'll, it'll tell you like how to do it. It's, well, I mean it'll say like, something up here it'll say this is the activator you need to find the activator code somewhere but <clears throat> anyways um so here's here's your code the bottom line you always need the bottom line right here for um an activator and up here is your activator code if you don't want an activator you delete this and you delete this and this is just your code so i don't know the whole list i'll post it in the description um, for the whole list of activators, so if you want to make it the A button or the home button or this, some codes need activators and some don't. So, the first code is um, is this. Look in the little uh, Google thing. So if you have a Wiimote, you'll need to change it to this. Uh, well, no, you don't need to. You could change it to whatever. But this is the home button for the Wiimote, and this is the home button for the class controller. So you just put this. You take this code and you put it right here. And I'll, like I said before, I'll post a link in the description so you can click that and then you can put in whatever code you want and make it the jump button or something. So now we got activators out of the way. Um, I'll teach you how to edit um, edit codes that are not activator related. Um, So right here, you can find the color values at um, some color, um, some like places that have like color wheels. Okay, I'm back, and this is like a, a good site for this. Um, see, this this number is your code. Pretty pretty straightforward. This is your code, and this is your code. Z value is the number. See, like they they some they normally tell you what it's. For. Oh wait, the F's. What are the F's for? Yeah, I don't know exactly what that's supposed to mean. But like right here, this is the the color code. You can find it right here. Get whatever color you want. Put it there. You got your your number. Um. <clears throat> so with these ones, well, I'm just gonna explain it in general instead of just looking for codes. Okay, so this uh, this ASC 11 to hex is for words. So if there's a word code and you want it to say, like let's say a name changer. Like I'm not going to get into buttons and stuff this video. But let's say you just wanted to change your name to Cheese Toast. Now don't, don't copy my name, please. But um, <clears throat> what you do is you take you type this in right here. This this could be anything. Um, just don't like you could put special characters in here like A's and stuff and paste them in here, but not all characters are allowed like Japanese characters and stuff. They you can't use those. Those it'll I think it'll just erase the character in your code. But so you get this and then you put the down arrow. So that's your code. Um, but now you can see there's this pat like this pattern. It's eight space eight enter space eight space eight. So what you need to do is you need to fill this up, and then there's your code, and then you can put this code um, into here. So what you would do, uh, where is it? You would take, <coughs> um, you would take this code right here, and you would put it right here, and then you put this code right here, and then you put that code right here, and then you keep doing that. Um, so that that's how you convert. That's how you find the X's for words and stuff. Float is the most commonly used. It's for um, it's for most things. So, let's say there's a moon jump code, right? And you want it to be ten times higher. Like like let's say one. This code is your average, like your normal jump. If you put this in a code, it'll just be the normal thing. Well, if you wanted to jump ten times higher, you put in your moon jump code, ten. You put this into the X's. 
So, well, I'm not going to take time to look through it, but you get the point. Like, if this was a, uh, if this if this one line was just um, uh, what a moon jump, you would, you would take this copy and put it in here, and save it. Um, and right here is it's very not it's not very common. They'll norm they'll normally say like right here, or they'll say convert with hex hex the float or whatever. But normally, or no, hexadecimal, but hexadecimal is normally uh, stats and stuff, and you get the point. You type it in, you do it, oh yeah, I forgot to say, you can put in, you can put in whatever, and then you can click down arrow. Um, same thing as this. Oh, wait, what? Yeah, I don't know if that's, oh wait, that that's messed up. But... I just found a glitch, but anyways, uh, I don't know what hex uh, signed means. I'm not a coder. I don't make codes, but this is pretty basic stuff. Um, so if you have any questions, uh, just um, leave a comment. I, I respond to all comments, so yeah. Okay, thanks for watching. Can you subscribe to this account and maybe subscribe to my other account, uh, The Lost Host? Uh, it's T H E uh, L O S T T O A S T. Because uh, that would be great. Um, and yeah. So, peace out.